Welcome back to the Five Napkin Burger Beer and Bourbon Blog, featuring us, the Happy Hour Guys, and have we got a treat for you. Pappy Van Winkle, 20-year-old bourbon. Woohoo! Let's skip right to the history on this one. The old Rip Van Winkle distillery goes back four generations. It all started in the late 1800s with their patriarch of bourbon, Julian P. Pappy Van Winkle. And it was Pappy's expertise in the bourbon industry that led them to the recipes they use today. I'm sorry I have to do this to you because you're not actually here tasting this with me. However, it's in the interest of research. All of the Rip Van Winkle bourbons are unique in that they are what is called weeded bourbons. That means the recipe of grains used to make the bourbons, of course it includes corn, but instead of rye, it substitutes wheat. And that influence on the bourbon makes it mellower, but also makes it able to age and age and age. Look at the number on this bottle. That's a 20, folks. You can smell the vanilla here. I mean, okay, all that time in the barrel. Magic, total magic. Do you want this? You can't have it. All right, take it. <laughs> oh, man, Mother. man, oh man. But there's a lot of vanilla, a lot of caramel. Tons. And I, and I totally get why that would make a fantastic milkshake. Yep. Yes, that's right. You did hear Mark say Pappy 20 and vanilla milkshake in the same sentence. Turns out that all that time in the barrel puts a ton of vanilla into this bourbon, and it shows up beautifully in a delectable, and very expensive vanilla milkshake. And yes, at Five Napkin, they'll make you one. But do yourself a favor, head on down to Five Napkin and try it on its own first. And remember these three words, life is good. We'll see you guys next time. Cheers.